Dude, crank, I put on the Indie Rock channel because this is an indie film. So John Ludwig called me about an hour ago. And, and told me about the shirt he bought for the party. Oh my gosh, God. are you kidding me? No, I'm... Does he not realize our schedule? Yeah, no, he, he doesn't even really know what we're doing tonight. Oh. <laughs> He's like, you sound like you've been sleeping. I was like, yes, John. Um, the team is going to be pulling an all-nighter to install mannequins to further enhance our company. <laughs> and, in other words, start a revolution in a city which we have never been. And he's like... That's great. You know what I got today? A fierce shirt for the party. <laughs> and I was like, are you serious? That's what this phone call's about? Yeah. Yeah, for real. No, and that's what I was like. I was like, how fierce is it, John? He goes, it's, it's pretty tough. He's like, you're going to have to step it up. And I go, excuse me? I might get arrested tonight, John. I might be, I might, I might be taken out of the butters by some cellmate. No. <laughs> this is October, November 8th. We're in November. Yeah. November 8th. <laughs> doing it at a uh, super awesome installation. Piedmont Avenue in Atlanta. Gorilla marketing team. In the car we have C Dubs, Corey Miller. Woo woo! Also known as what's your what's your what's your Fraggle name? Rock. Fraggle Rock. Code name Fraggle Rock. Jenny. Clark. Formerly known as Jenny Rosaka. Rosaka. Codename Steel Magnolia. Mark Hugger. Codename Viper Viper. We have Chris Rank. Codename Twinkle Toes. Backseat. Sleeping Dragon. Also known as Sleeping Dragon. <laughs> also ruined our chance to sleep this evening. Corey and I have, have yet to sleep today. That's cool. We're ready to rock and roll. It might make this film funnier. It could very well make this film funnier. You know what else makes this film funnier? Cold beers. Cold beers. Totally out of the box in terms of advertisement. Uh, normally it's done with uh, retail outlets and you associate mannequins with retail establishments and the opening and grand openings of retail. Never before have I seen it done with property management. I think it's cool. Like when you drive by, it's uh -huh. like you, you want to stop and look at it. Yeah. I think it's cool. Yeah, what did yeah. you think when you first saw it? Um, I thought it was kind of creepy. Kind of Because I didn't know what it was for, but then when we found out, it was, yeah. it was cool. Yeah, we love this it. This is amazing. We love it. Yes, yeah, we drove, we actually drove by, and um, we saw it, but we had to come back by oh, to really? take pictures with it. Because this, this is the best advertising ever for a condo. Oh, there she go, right? This is awesome. Very weird, very strange. Really caught our attention. And, uh... So, hats off. Thought they were real people. Yes. I don't, didn't know what the heck was going on. Okay, so there was this homeless guy out, and we were all scared to go outside and smoke a cigarette because he kept talking to everybody. But we all look outside, and he's talking to the mannequin, and you see him just kind of gesturing towards it. <laughs> we're expecting him to like start hitting it and like punching it and stuff, and then um, then Ben was like. I'm gonna go down and tell him that the, the mannequin down at that end is talking about him. <laughs> we were gonna try to instigate. <laughs> it was fun. But this makes, we was just saying we that. We were just saying, it makes you stop. So. Yeah, and it makes you wanna like live in this area. Right, you know? yeah, we saw him and I was like. We didn't know it had developed this much over here. It's, it's really, it's came up a lot. This is the best. We like, it's yeah. Cool. It's yeah. definitely a show stop. Yeah. I don't even know where the goggles came from, but. I'm pretty glad they're here. <laughs>